Hello everybody, this is Adam Petey here, and today I'm going to be talking about what's been going on recently, or talking about what's been what's going to come next for in the future, and this is the 2017 update part 2. I haven't done it for a while, and I feel like doing it, because why not? So first off, on my previous video, the Up Up Decay Weekly got up to almost a thousand views, like, oh god damn, dude, like, that is like... My most popular Killing Floor 2 Let's Play. By far. Like, by far. I mean, like, the unboxing series, they don't count because they're, they're not Let's Plays. They're more like the unboxing stuff. And also, recently on my sub count, I have reached up to, for now, 1,755 subscribers. And... Holy shit, I am gaining subs a lot recently. Like, like, I remember, like, last year, I never usually gain a lot of subs. I'm more like, sure, like, I get one or two. That's just pretty much it, like, a day or two. But now, since I made the return of the unboxing series and made a giveaway video, I am getting a lot of subs just because of those vi two things. Like, <laughs> holy shit. If you guys want me to keep going on KF2, then sure, I will in the future. But just to put it out there, I will be doing like other things that aren't Killing Floor 2 related. And some of you might be pissed about it. Some of you might be wondering, well, why, man? Why? Just because you got that much doesn't mean we'll bother watching that video. Yeah, I, I kind of get that. But I mean, like, I, I just feel like doing something that isn't KF two related like once or twice a month or something I don't know just pretty much any time I feel like it and besides I have to anyways I mean like I haven't done like my series called the Gmod zombie apocalypse in like quite a while I mean like I've made episode three already this year finally but god damn I'm just lose kinda losing track on that and it's gonna take forever because now, like, like now, I've like erased everything on my computer and put everything all back together. And the reason why I did that is because of my internet. Like, out of nowhere, one day, my internet just stopped. I mean, like, I've tried connecting to other networks and it just wasn't doing shit so I had I, right now I have to use a cable obviously it can't be wireless anymore like if I pull the cable my internet will just stop immediately I mean like I've tried everything and I guess it didn't work so I guess I'll have to deal with that for now well I'll probably take back of what I said I I haven't tried everything I mean like I tried some things but I haven't tried like all of it so I'm still trying to fix that and also my monitor is still being a complete piece of shit because usually when I play Killing Floor and Killing Floor 2, Payday 2, Left 4 Dead 2, all the other games you could kind of think of, every time I get into some serious gaming, my internet I mean, my monitor just blacks out, and then it just basically resets itself every time. And it's honestly so fucking annoying. It just pisses me off through time to time, and I, I get it in some serious rage once it comes into actually gaming a bit seriously. And what else? What else? Right, I will... Might be collabing with somebody that, of course, it isn't going to be Zinc because he's having problems with his PC... It's gonna be somebody else, but I don't know if I want to collab with this person. We were gonna actually plan on doing, playing, not doing. God damn it! Who's your daddy? And if you don't know what that is, it's pretty much a funny game. It's it's fun. You should check it. And uh, I don't know if I really wanted to collab with him. I kind of can't trust the guy. I mean, like. He doesn't really support me, and, man, like, I support him, and he doesn't support me, like, god damn. So, 
I see how it is, so I don't support him anymore because he doesn't support me. So you know, if that's gonna be like that, then fine. I'll I'll just I'll just do that. But I'll maybe maybe, but I don't know. I I kind of can't trust the guy. I'm not gonna be telling who he is, obviously, like his YouTube channel, because I. I just I I just can't trust anybody these days like I used to trust a lot of people but I used to trust like an actual close friend who I thought was an actual close friend in the end he was a traitor he backstabbed me unsubbed me unliked all of my videos don't think I'm joking because I am not joking he was actually my number one best friend in real life, and I can't believe he'd do that. That's actually a notice if friends are backstabbing you right there, just putting it out there. It actually did happen, really. But I'm over it. And also, the next video that I was thinking about doing is, of course, a Killing Floor 2 gameplay. And pretty much it's gonna be the week it's gonna be about the weekly instead of actually doing it solo I feel like doing it with with subscribers on multiplayer so if you are interested then uh, just just join me I don't know when I'm gonna be doing that but I'll be doing that at some point and I might get some subs because a few of my fans actually ended up adding me on Steam and if you want to add me then go right ahead but if if you look suspicious if your profile is suspicious due to privateness then I'll might remove you just for a heads up just comment saying that you're a fan or something just explain please it, it doesn't have to be too much if you want not forcing you well you kinda have to but god damn it and finally I guess for now for this video I think I guess is that I've been getting this one dislike recently by this one guy and I got a f and I I I fucking knew it guys I honestly knew it it was those opolis one of the opolis which just couldn't move on like I made a video about them and pretty much I didn't really explain too well and um man I was given a little bit of proof but not too much but these guys are are just are just bad influences like you guys shouldn't even bother like hating on these guys like you'll probably make the situation worse like just to just avoid them just avoid all content do not like start an argument or something because that argument is just probably going to go non-stop. And honestly, arguments are just a waste of space anyways. So pretty much this Steam group is filled with racists. And pretty much the reason why I left that group. And oh wait, l let me explain of how I, I started and of how I joined the group. So pretty much I was on an idle server on TF2. Yes, I know TF2 is pretty much a bad game. Toxic. Yeah, I know. I quitted that game a long time ago. So, the past, I, I used to join an idle server. And I was just sniping, of course. And then I met a, met the group owner. Then he said that he wanted members to join his group. So then I was like, uh, cool. And then he was like, hey, you want to join? And I was like, okay, sure, sure. Whatever. <laughs> I wasn't being sarcastic, I was like, okay. But it was like private, so then he had to like add me and for me the in order to join. So then that happened, I joined the group. And then afterward he made me a group officer in that group because of my Steam level. Which back then I think it was like um around level seventy, I think. I I can't remember really, like to be honest, I don't, no, 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 I think 60, I, I don't remember, but, so he did, and then, 
a few days later, he removed me, and I asked him why he removed me, and he was like, well, because we want active members, we want active members up in here, and I was like, oh, okay, I can fully understand it, but then I've realized that some of the members weren't active at all, and I was like, oh, God, he was he must have been bullshitting me, but whatever, not really that pissed. So then later on, I knew something was up. One of the moderators, of course, he was the one who started the whole thing. He was obviously offensive and probably born offensive too. Like, he's been like on the microphone like saying a quote from Keemstar, of course, from Keem's offensiveness as well. Uh, sorry, I was distracted by an insect that was on my desk. I'm, I'm so sorry, guys. And of course, his voice sounded like a squeaker. Of course. God. But you know what? I just kind of dealt with it. I more likely muted him just because of way of how he acts. And then time goes by, right? And then we more likely trolled a brony server. Which, holy shit, I was dying of laughter from some random parts. I can't remember what part it is that caused me to laugh, but... I don't know, something... I was, like, actually dying. Like, literally dying. I skipped a few heartbeats because of it. Jesus Christ. We were basically, like, trolling brony servers. I, I know I said that twice. I, I don't know why I bothered saying it twice, but whatever. Whatever. Then time goes by later on. This is where all the bullshit started. And of course, the person who did it was that racist squeaker. And he made an announcement, well, about the Moon Man lyrics, of course. And I don't really know what that was back then, so then I decided to listen to it. And I was like, well, I guess that was a mistake. I, I, I just wish I never listened to that song again, which I didn't listen to that song again. And, but it wasn't really that bad, I guess. But then that same person made another announcement about another Moon Man thing. And this is where shit got heavy. And I was like, oh, no, 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 no. No, no more. I'm I'm through with this group. I'm done. I'm gonna pretend that I am no that that I barely know these people that I ever known this group. I'm gonna ever forget about them and ever forget about the group and ever forget about that me meeting them. So then I did all that right, left the group, and then removed everybody and then blocked them afterward. And then later on, I, f I felt like getting rid of it out of my head, so then I made that video, and then they've actually noticed. And then they were going all ape shit in the comment section, and then they were blocked from com contacting me, of course, on YouTube. And now, they may look like they're not offensive, but they truly are. They truly are. They are. They, they're just not announcing anything offensive be because if they obviously do they'll lose more members and if if you are a member of that group like just to put it out there if you are and if you're on my friends list right now honestly you're gonna get removed and I'm gonna just not gonna deal with it I'm not I've had it had it with that group ever since, man. Like, goddamn. Don't bother joining that group. They're a bad influence. They have, they have bad behavior. So, that's it for this video. I think this is like my longest update ever, I think. Uh, I don't think it is, though. So, again, I guess that's it. Next video will be an upped up decay and multiplayer, either playing with subs or strangers, I don't know. 
And please give it a like for the support because I'm doing this at a late time and I'm going to be uploading this later on early in the morning or afternoon. And that's it and I'll see you guys next time.